thread through the, I don't have an empty one, but there's a hole yes. in it. You're going to put the thread on the In the inside. hole. I, no, I okay. do that with the okay, other so one. and then you're going to move it this yes. way. Yes, yes. And you're going to hit the foot pedal, and uh -huh. it's just going to wind. Okay. Okay, so you're... So that's the only place where you have to... That's the only place where we're bobbing. Excuse me, and I don't have to release no. so that the motor doesn't. No. Okay. And I don't have to do that. In other words, I can fill the bobbin without touching this. Correct. Okay. Yeah, With the other the one, I have to it. loosen this don't so that the motor it. doesn't run, and no. only that runs. Okay. Once this is on this side, it oh. knows that it's running, uh, filling a bobbin. Okay. okay. Great. And okay. Then when you're done, it pops back out this okay. way. You take it off. Okay. Okay. Very good. And now to load the bobbin, this comes off like this. Yes. I just push that towards the right. Yes. To pop this case off. Mm -hmm. Okay. You always want your thread coming off to the left. Yes. Okay. And then you're just going to place it in the case, and then you're going to get it into the tension. Mm -hmm. So you're going to go through here, and just follow the arrows uh -huh. through here, and then you're going to pop this plastic case back on. Okay, now let me try that. You pushed it that way, and you can get this out. How do I get the bobbin out? Just with your finger, right okay. here. You can just lift it right out. Okay. So, put it in. And it goes over here. And bring it around to get it through the disc. Oh, I didn't see that part. Here. Okay, and then up on top. And then around, and then right here. Back. All right, let me try okay. that. Okay, it's loose now. So it's down through here first. Yeah. And then up there. My fingers are so cramped. Oh, it's right yep, there. Yep, you got it. I was trying to do it up there. Okay. And then down to down, this one. Down through this. Yep, there you oh, go. Okay. Then hold I on see. to the okay. tail Whoops. and put this back on. And it, then you're it gonna, cut okay. up, it cut it off. That's fine. Okay. And then pop. Okay. Is it in? No. Though? I'm going to show you a little trick. Okay, so this piece. Yes. You're going to want to hook underneath this piece first. Okay? See how I oh, hooked it right underneath? underneath. Oh, okay. I was and then it, it just is going to pop closed. Okay. Okay? Underneath. Okay. I'm still not getting it underneath. She's shaking too much. That's fine. There yeah. you go. Okay. okay. Did you feel that when it clicked? Yes. Okay. I did. You know, with anything, it just takes practice. Yeah. Once you do it a few times, okay. there you go. Yeah, okay. okay. So that's done. Now, for threading, the needle. I always find it easier to thread when you stand. Okay. Because okay, you're looking on the top of the machine. If you're sitting down, you kind of can't really okay. sit. Okay, so you're going to come through this. You're going to put it through here. Okay. You're going to go in through the bottom. Okay. Oh, from underneath yeah. towards the back. Then you're going to come here. Uh huh. And you're also going to follow these arrows, okay? So mm -hmm. if this is threading, you're going to follow this mm -hmm. arrow. You're going to come down here, mm -hmm. through here, and you're going to come and take get that into the tension. Yes. Okay, like that. Mm -hmm. then, then you're going to come down, bring it through there, through here. Oh, boy. Okay, then you're going to lower your presser foot. Yeah. This comes down. You're gonna put, and this is gonna be a little tricky at mm -hmm. first, but once you get the hang of it, it will be fine. Okay. And I'm at a horrible angle as well. Okay. 
Okay, so this is in the front of the needle. You're gonna mm -hmm. bring it all the way to the back and then to the front, and you're gonna release both at the same time so it makes that loop, and then you're just gonna pull the loop through and then shoot the needle. Oh boy. I know it looks like a lot of steps, but it yeah. isn't it's very easy. Down, down, Did you want to try? Mm -hmm. Or you want to watch me do it one no, more time? Sir. Yeah. We're off up your thread. No, sir. So when we take thread, we always want to cut it from the top. Mm -hmm. and the okay, we don't ever want to reverse pull our thread. Oh, okay. okay. Well, I'll, 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 I'll be right back with you, okay? Hang on just a second. Good afternoon. Thank you for calling the Golden Beyond. You can help. Please hang up now. Okay, so you're going to come. Hello? You're going to hold it with yes. both hands. Yeah. You're going to come through the bottom of this device. This, this one. Yes. Here. Through here. Oh, oh, back up. You're going to get this into the tension. Yes. It, it's going to kind of click in. Yeah. Okay, then you're going to come down. Back down the same way. Through here. Wait, I, that and part there I didn't get. Right through here. Oh, I see. There's an opening. Through here. Okay. Okay. Then you're mm -hmm. going to lower your presser foot. And if this is tight like this is, you yes. know you have it in intention. If it's loose and you can Work pull it, this thread, yeah. you know it's not in intention and it's not right. Tight. Okay. Okay, so this should be tight like this. Yes. You're going to bring your threader down mm -hmm. to make sure it comes totally in front of the needle. Yes. Okay. Yeah, well, you were using like um, King Todd or some kind of heavy thread, thread in the bottom, right? You hook Here. it on that gadget. Yeah. Okay. Okay, then you bring it all the way. So that it catches towards the back, towards the back. you're going to bring yeah. it towards the front, okay, and so then you're going to let them both go at okay. the same time very gently, and it makes that loop. And then you're going to pull the loop through and then you can thread it. <laughs> okay. Okay? Fine. Okay, now tension. How do you. Uh, you're never going to touch this dial. It's going to be set at number four, uh -huh. and it's always going to stay at number four. Oh, okay. And you, and you shouldn't have any issues. The, um, what if I want a, a two and a half inch stitch or four inch stitch? Then because when I'm doing it in the ditch, I like okay. a longer yep. stitch. So did you? I just pushed the plus button. Yes. Now it's three point five, three point yeah. eight, four point zero. Oh. Okay. Okay, that's your stitch length. Okay. Now, when you adjust the stitch length, does the bobbin respond to yes. the tension? Mm -hmm. I don't have to, don't, because on the you, other one, yeah, I have two yeah. separate gadgets. Mm -hmm. If you leave this on four, four, you shouldn't have an issue. Okay, okay, okay. okay. All right, that was a quickie.